go ahead. <coughs> Just cut like you're a motorcycle. <laughs> I know what I'm gonna do. I got four wheels, but I'm just gonna pretend, just right now, never again, just right now, I'm gonna pretend like I got two wheels. You know, because deep down inside, I really wanna own a motorcycle. And so, just right now, just this one time, I'm gonna act like I got two wheels. <laughs> and I, I, I know, I know, I got four. But I'm gonna act like I got two wheels. Don't trip. I'll be all right. I'm not trying to make anybody mad. <laughs> Crazy fool right there. That's just death wish right there. Freaking going flying through. I don't get that. I mean, he gave me a little rev bomb, but golly. Don't get it. What is so important that you'd be willing to go that fast? Are you in that big of a hurry? Is your wife having a baby at the hospital? Who will decide what is best for your child? Insurance administrators or doctors? Are your boys playing Battlefield? Oh my god! It's time running out! Let's go! And you're trying to get home so you can join their squad? What is so important? I don't know. I don't know, that's a good question. I don't think anything is worth putting your life at risk. I don't get that. I, is anything worth putting your ability to ride the next day? Is that worth it? By doing some crazy stuff like lane splitting going freaking 40 miles an hour? So, just got out of DMV, just got my, my uh, personalized license plate that says I am law for my Yamaha and that was the biggest pain in the ass that I've ever gone through with regards to having to deal with DMV. DMV is, is California DMV, like most... Uh, government ran businesses slash operations are just it's just it's just I don't even know how to explain it. Okay. Yes, no, no, listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. Oh, oh my God. I mean there's it's just one thing after another. One problem after another. When I first came here just to pick up my license plate I had to get my bike inspected because it, it was coming from out of state. Had it inspected and my motorcycle, my Yamaha R1, does not have an EPA sticker on it. Because it was originally sold outside of California. And California sucks balls. So I had to have Yamaha send me a letter, an official letter, stating that my motorcycle needed the EPA requirements. If that isn't the biggest crock of shit, excuse my language, but I had the original pink slip, right? The original sales document that stated that it was sold in the United States because it was originally sold in Virginia. 
But that wasn't good enough for California. Um, even though my VIN number and everything matched the original pink slip and my original documentation that shows my bike was, was sold in the United States. So I had to wait for Yamaha's legal department to send me a document that states that my bike was made for the United States. Golly, golly. But it's over with now. <clears throat>